has kept me just another day So when all these things began to happen, stand and look up, for your salvation is near. When we live this Christian life, when we began to look around and see what's going on in our nation and in the world that we live in now, we can say we're going through some real stuff. The church is under attack right now. God's children are really going through some things, and we're at the point now where we can't do pity pat church. <laughs> we can't play around in the church anymore. We can't come in here and worry about chicken dinners and car sales. We can't worry about car washes and all of that because souls are really in the need of being saved. And what we need to do now is look up where we're at. Now, Brian, Brian, you're saying look up, but, but I need you to understand where we are because at this present time, if you ever look up, think about where you're at. When you look up, you're at a low place. Now, in the text on the day, Jesus is talking to his disciples because in the beginning of, chap of Luke chapter 21, you'll find that Jesus is telling the disciples there is some tragedy coming and it's on the way. I need you to understand that destruction is on the way. I need you to understand that punishment is on the way. I need you to understand that there are some real issues coming, but some of it is because of your misbehavior, but some of it is just because of life. But I need you to understand, even though you're going through, I need you to understand you're protected, but I need you to look up. Now, what is the benefit of looking up when all hell is breaking loose in my life? What is the benefit of looking up when every time I turn around, it's always something? What is the benefit when I'm 
nothing but drama. It's nothing but confusion. Why do I look up when I come to church and I'm thought more in the church than I am in the street? Why do I continue to look up when I'm trying to be faithful to God? But it just seems like the word of the waters and the waves just keep on shaking and rocking me. Why do I look up when I'm glad that you asked on this afternoon? Because when I look up, I understand that my help comes from up above. I understand that that is nothing around me. Understand, understand, understand that Jesus is saying you all are going to be in some low places. You're not going to be on the side of the mountain. You're not going to be going across the water. You ain't going up and down hills. But you're going to be in a valley experience. And, and if you've ever been down in a valley between two mountains, you understand the only 